Right, let's let's see if we can get this done. As the Watcher, we're a thousand points away. I'm gonna only do Ascension 1, right? I think we're fine handling Elites and it's more XP, but I don't think we can we can do just more dangerous enemies. So Curse for a rare card. Or three potions. Mm, I think the Curse is fine. And our choice is Enter Divinity but die. Three block for each card in your hand or 10 damage if fatal upgrade a random card in your deck. Lesson learned is kind of nice, but the upgrade isn't that great. Well, I guess we're going with Divinity. Oh, sorry, Blasphemy. I was meant to right click, so I want to see what the upgrade was. Having that with Retain is definitely fantastic, right? Just a, a straight triple turn, gain three resources. Anyway, we need to go to the shop straight away because I want to get rid of the curse. Hmm. Enter Divinity, but die next turn. I mean, that's enough to KO, right? Yeah. Done. They're definitely super useful, especially in early fights. We just want the cards to weave correctly. Definitely upgrade it. Retain it till it's absolutely necessary. Decay, take two damage, that sucks. Well, let's attack, attack, and then defend. And then we should be able to KO with Divinity, I assume. No, we didn't even get it, never mind. So it's, no, it's Vigilance, Miracle, Eruption, Strike, Strike, ah, take damage. A little shy. Last me, Erupt. Crescendo, we definitely like, right? No, Wheel Kick. Draw is what really comes in handy, especially with the resource generation. What do we have? I don't think there's anything. Sands of Time is kind of interesting. Dramatic Entrance is good as well. Hmm. I think it's definitely removed the, the curse, though. And just hold on to the gold. We skipped the elites, which is a bit unfortunate. We're going to pay to remove another card. We're going to start getting rid of Defend and Strike. At least it Defends, because we, again, have, have Divinity. Whenever we want eruption, always the first thing to upgrade. I'm kind of sad we skipped the elites, actually. Gold. Gold for doubt. You know what? Sure. Gold for doubt. Can we get to another shop? Was that actually worth it? We can if we skip the elites. Well, we can get that one done. I don't like how many I've missed. It's a bit unfortunate. I don't think there's anything we want to upgrade. What's the wheel kick upgrade? 20 damage. Yeah, so it's not that great. We just need more cards. So we'll go this way. The Vigilance Blast Me now gets retained, so we do like that. I think it's fine, even with the weakness. Yeah, because now we can go... It's better to erupt first? No. Blast Me. Wheel kick. KOs. And strike KOs. Crescendo, third eye. Nope. Where's all our empty cards? Stack gold. I do like stacking gold. It means we can go for the double elites. This, not so good. Vigilance. Strike. Take the weakness, unfortunately. We know Blasphemy isn't in our deck, so. As soon as we use it, we can basically use Distilled Chaos. But I don't think we can KO three enemies, unfortunately. What we can do is do that, that, play it, get a bunch of strikes off, and then just block. Is that worth it? I don't think that was worth it. Yeah. Yeah. We're stuck in the state, and that's just the end of us, basically. Vigilance, Blasphemy. Will Kick. Strike, Strike, Strike. Almost ended really badly. Still not getting the cards we want. So we definitely don't want to erupt. Just push a little damage. Get a little block, take a lot of damage and die. Yeah, okay. That was to be expected. We we did not play that well enough. It's fine. 
racking up experience, that's the main thing, and we get the better perk, the one I like. Well, it was nice starting with that card. So, where are the elites for us to chase? I don't think there's one we can get to. Yeah, three, three. So no matter what, we lose our buff. So we might as well go this way, hit this shop, I think. Strike, strike. Empty mine, perfect. Empty mine is the one we want. Lots of. Yeah, because now we can go... I mean, we don't have to, because he's on my HP. But Vigilance, Empty Mind, Eruption, and so forth. Rush Down is definitely a great one, as well. Is it the shop straight, or is it just more cards? What would I even remove? I think it's just more cards. I like our setup. We do definitely want to thin it down, but for now it's fine. Empty Fist is good as well. Yeah. All right, now we actually have to fight. It is a bit worrisome. We can go Vigilance, Miracle, Erupt. And the uh, 12 will KO, and the Empty Fist should KO, so we go on you. 12, exit. Yeah, take four, survive. We definitely need to get to the upgrade. Four, four, and four. Sucks to take four, but it's better. At least I think it's better. I think it's just erupt, strike, regret my choices. That was it bad. We're slightly off. Didn't take too much damage, which is fine. Blow is definitely the big one. Double upgrade. Do we need the upgrade right away? I feel like we don't. They converge, so it doesn't really matter. Whether or not we want a question mark. So we're upgrading eruption. Okay, zero cost power is definitely good. We we'll go this way. Is it the wheel or match card? It's a wheel. I always have terrible luck with the wheel. It's probably gonna be a curse. Oh, it's health. I think it's just a heal, isn't it? It's not extra life. Yeah. It's not that grace, unfortunately. Upgrade eruption, that comes first, and then rush down comes next. It's good if we draw it and we can set up. We have Vigilance. It's annoying to waste those cards. That's a horrible hand. It's a bit better, but still not great. So it's that, that, that. Rush. Strike. I think it's just triple strike. We don't have to empty. We do have to now, though. We get the fist, which is good. We can go fist, blow, vigilance, blow. I want the extra armor. I don't think we need the extra armor. I think taking damage is fine. That, 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 that. We just double defend. It's close to KOing. Smiling mask, what does it do? Removal service always plus 50, that's great. We do kind of like Windmill Strike. At the end of your turn, if you're in Calm, gain 5. No, no, that's real worthwhile. It's just upgrade Rush Down. Get a decent relic. Lose HP, draw 3. We do kind of like that. There's no real good self damage though. Can we KO? I feel like we can KO one of them. Yeah. Take 11, which is unfortunate though. Draw a bunch. So it's blow. Might as well do that, because it's zero. That's... Yes, we hold. Need more ways to enter Wrath, it looks like. We don't have anything in the discard. I mean, it's resources, so that helps. Means we can do that and defend a little. Hoping for one more strike. All right, now this is a better payoff. That was not the card I was thinking, because we shuffled. It's fine. Shimmering fists. Shimmering fury. Simmering fury. 
The draw usually ends up backfiring on us though, but this is a decent start. Still taking damage, which is not so good. But now we get a rush down. It's in the discard, but we draw too much. Uh, it's the draw first, but so I have to get rid of some cards. At least we can KO one of them. Empty. Is it not? I'm sure it's in the graveyard. I guess it wasn't. Can, yes, we can KO. I need to stop overthinking it. So I do like... I do like brilliance. You can stack it nice and high, but it seems like a trick. It doesn't seem like an actual good card. I don't think we need that many more empty cards. You hate this elite so much. So, so much. Is it worth erupting? I'm gonna. Maybe we can KO this guy. Yeah, we can. It's not so bad. We're not drawing the days yet, either. We can exit the stance, which is good. Yes, it's just double defend at this point. Gonna draw the dazes now. I don't like that they're off sequence. It makes it really bad. Hopefully we can carry one of them next turn. And not draw dazes. Kinda. Blow. Rot. I'm confused. Are we not changing stances? We are. But we didn't get back again. Curious. Every fourth room is a chest. That is definitely nice. Tantrum is fantastic. Vault is the better card, though. Thorns. I don't think we want thorns. I think the fear is better. Yeah, vulnerability is nice. So we still have... No, we don't have tiny more. I want to upgrade. I think double upgrade is better. So now we can upgrade vaults. Shop. See what we get. Choose an attack to always start with. What attack would that be? I guess it would be the blows. So that we can always get into our graveyard. Is it better than moving a card? I feel like it's better than moving a card. Because it just leads to so much extra damage. And we can even upgrade it now. Right, so it is more damage. Otherwise, what would we pick? Nothing, really. You have to start working on removing cards, though. But yeah, so we can go that, that, that. Not really, yeah, anything. I suppose we might as well take the draw, then. All right, we can erupt. Do that. Just waste, basically. We get Vault, which is nice. So I guess it's Vigilance, Blow, Miracle, Vault. Empty Mind. Not get anything at all, though. Well, play the Slime cards. Double Strike. Ah, I split him. No, preparing. Good, good. I did split him. That was going to be the worry. Secret weapon. Put a skill from your draw pile into your hand. Put an attack. We have tantrum though, don't we? No, we didn't take tantrum. So I need to take an attack. Right, allows us to get eruption. It should be fine. I do get to pick, right? Yeah, good. Okay. We do definitely want to duplicate something. We erupt. We can then play that. No, I completely forgot to do that. So we lost some damage, but it's fine. Yeah, it's very fine. Ragnarok is definitely a fantastic card. What's the upgrade? It's just more damage. No longer Smith seems horrible. No longer Rest seems kind of horrible. But as long as I play smart, it'll pay off. 
Maybe I didn't need the extra resources against normal fights, but we grabbed Ragnarok, which is quite hefty. I want to go to the shop. I don't really care about going to the true boss. Right. It's every fourth question mark, so I do want to hit a bunch of them. So maybe it's this way. Yeah, that should lead to a good treasure chest. This is horrible. Well, actually, maybe we can get enough attacks off. To knock one of them down at the very least. Way too much block, though. I need to remove some of the defense. Vault is definitely good. So it's definitely that. Definitely that. Actually, that was probably a wrong choice. Eh. I think that was misplayed. Yeah, because now this is doing too much damage. Do we just Ragnarok? No, we definitely blow first. It doesn't matter who we blow. God. We need to stop phrasing like that. Rushdown's free. It's Ragnarok, then empty. Yeah. Empty mind. No blow, take 12. I think I could play that a lot better. We get another Ragnarok. Six. I mean, it should knock him down at the very least, right? Yeah. So then we can Shimmer and then KO him next turn. Yeah, this doing 50 damage is definitely really good. Another blow. Question marks. Maybe if you grab a power upgrade it. I don't know if we're going to get that many powers. Definitely remove guard. Remove defend. Yeah, you're just trying to armor up, so that definitely works for us. Might as well do the damage. There's the other blow. There's rush down. Unfortunately, we did not draw our sense changes. And we shuffle. And we still didn't draw them. So I definitely have way too many cards in the deck. We can vault, so that's a little better. Let's vigilance. Then erupt. Blow. Strike. Vault. No, Ragnarok KOs. Yeah. We gotta look at the HP more. I think it's definitely about removing cards. So, either way we hit a question mark. Hit two question marks. It's the campfire is better. 50 for 100, 50 for 250. Well, we have hardly any gold, so I'm going to do that. Cool, we win. We hate groups of enemies, but we have good damage straight away. We can erupt. I guess KO the other one. I don't like wasting the damage though. Bolts. Eight damage is better. Rush down. Empty fists. Blow, blow. Vigilance. Yes, this is much better. This is what we wanted. In terms of just putting out damage. And we have Ragnarok. There we go. Simmering. Yo, I think we just do Ragnarok, it's 25 damage. Maybe the strike would have been better there too. Okay, how do we play this? We don't have anything in our graveyard. I think it's Vigilance back into it. We need the draw, but to use the draw, we need cards to get out of our hand. Do the 12. Do 12. Play the Vigilance. Play the Eruption. Play the Blows. Alright, we got there because of Rushdown. So when this is on zero, I think is when we get the extra. Maybe you add a card to that game. Gold. Yeah, when zero is when we get the chest, I believe. We can take another Rushdown. It's already zero cost. Yes, that's kind of good. 
There is too much draw in this style of deck, unfortunately. Extra damage. I don't think there's anything that's cost reduction. I'm assuming everything is just increasing the cost. Uh, increasing just base damage. So Ragnarok being one extra and then one extra is definitely better. Blue Candle, Sapphire Key. We'll take the key now. There's nothing to upgrade, so we'll go for the Elite. Kunai definitely helps. Don't like this matchup. But we have Bolts. So we do that. We'll do that. Draw two. We'll do that. We'll do that. Get the buff at the very least. Ah, oh, this is defense. Damn. I thought that was the extra attack. So we have Vigilance, which is something, I suppose. We don't draw. It's unfortunate. We're not super defensive. We can weaken. I feel like that's kind of worthwhile. He usually lasts the longest. But the issue is now we draw the, the fists back. Yeah. We don't like. We go Erupt. Just Ragnarok. Ragnarok. Vigilance. Miracle. Empty Fist. Strike. Have enough block, so simmering. There's our blues. Unfortunate. Definitely take another one. It's it's really just about getting them into the graveyard. If we can get them into the graveyard. We're super happy. Take care of the healer first. Just punch him a bunch. Also enable us to, you know, get defense, which is good. Kind of close to being able to KO. Heals for 20. No, he did strength. Good. So, Empty Mind is definitely correct. Do that. Simmer. Strike. I guess play a defense. If not. Double, double. Might as well burn them. Ragnarok? Does enough. Perfect. So maybe we, we could have taken the non-rest. We did take the non-rest. Alright, so it's good we took the non-rest. Well, every time I add cards, we get gold. Ah, it's too late. Well, it's not too late, but it's too late. <laughs> Rush down, blow, erupt. This knocks him unconscious. It's good. We'll try and KO him. I don't think we can KO the other one. Which is bad. We have, like, no block. I'm going to do this so we don't have to worry. It's probably wasteful. But now that's just more guaranteed damage where we want it. Signature move is never going to work. Might as well do the elite. Stabby Stabby is definitely bad. Especially when we don't actually get any good... Defense or attack options, I should say. We didn't draw them, so we're in a good position. As long as we just have too many cards in hand again. I think it's Vigilance first. Do that. Let me erupt. Do that. I should have maybe taken the draw. We can Simmer, we can Strike, and then we can Bolt. Ragnarok is 50 damage. No, it's way more than that, actually. Yeah, done. I don't know how the boss is going to go. Art of War is horrible. Mental Fortress is really good. Don't like this fight. Right, take care of one little guy at a time. Did I just played Still Chaos to avoid damage. Going into the boss, I feel like we kind of have to. We got Bolt, which definitely works. Corrupt. Do enough damage. No, thank you. 
Right, can't rest, which sucks. Is there anything we really want to upgrade? I think we take the key here. And we hope we can get past this guy. That's some good damage to start off. That kind of helps. This is more set up for the next turn, though. That. We have Vault, which definitely helps. I need to get rid of cards in hand, though. Do we empty mind? No, the draw two recycles. So we fist. Blow, blow, blow. Corrupt. Ah, because of rush down. That's annoying. Not Ragnarok either. We vigilance empty mind. That puts us to two, which allows us to then vault. There's a chance we can put the things in our graveyard. Which I think is worthwhile. Right? Do we miracle for some extra damage or do we just vault? I think we just vault here. Actually, I think vaulting was a bad option. Because we had a ton of armor. I mean, we should get a ton of armor here anyway. Yeah, because our dex is going up a ton. So it's definitely that. Definitely that. An end. Drawing back the blows definitely sucks. Empty mind. That sucks because we didn't have enough space. Yeah, we keep messing up because we don't. We just don't draw enough. Uh, Simmering Fist doesn't matter because we're staying in the stance. So it's a strike, and then wait. He's buffing, which is definitely good. Is this Ragnarok? Into Simmer? The draw? No, I don't want to draw. It's just more strength, right? Yeah. Alright, so we have to try and KO him. Which is definitely doable. Not if we don't draw decently. Well, unfortunately, this appears to be the end. Maybe not, because that's a ton of block. It's enough, though. I don't know if it's enough. It wasn't enough. Did we get the unlock? Nope. Oh, well. What can you do? Anyway, hope you enjoyed. Next one should be it, hopefully. Fingers crossed.